Hello, this is Hawk Kudabin, and today we are going to be reading SCP-4714. Because my computer decided to have an oopsie whoopsie and destroy any progress I made with a certain video that I was, I was in the middle of making. Which was going to be a much longer and more fun video, but we have an SCP video instead because it's shorter and it won't and will hopefully not have my computer run out of memory like this piece of rubbish that it is. Anyway, let's get it into this. Item number SCP-4714 Object Class Safe Special Containment Procedures STF Lambda 24 Babysitters will monitor SCP-4714-A for appearance of new subjects. Subjects will be fitted with a GPS transmitter, bracelet, and necessized and removed from the immediate area. Upon the manifestation, subjects will be tracked and SCP-4714 instances will be confiscated. Currently, all 63 SCP-4714 instances in containment are stored in a safe class item con storage container at Site-19. There is an instance of SCP-4714. Oh my goodness, it's a cute little pony. Or I guess, unicorn. Description, SCP-4714 refers to an unknown number of plush dolls, each resembling a pink unicorn with white feet and mane. A small paper card is attached to right flank by a plastic fastener. This card reads, One Entertainment presents My Unicorn Friend. Make a wish and come to play for girls of ages 5 to 8 from SCP-4714's attached card. The back says, Skies can turn gray. Feeling blue? Have we got a friend for you? A hug and a wish and your dreams come true. I want to play with the unicorns too. <sighs> when held by a female individual between the ages of 5 to 8 who are after the subject, SCP-4714 is capable of instant Instantaneously transporting, teleporting the subject to a secondary location, identified as an abandoned stable in data redacted Kentucky. Hereafter, SCP-4714-A. Teleportation to SCP-4714-A occurs when the subject holds SCP-4714 and makes a verbal request similar nature to that printed on the attached card. Notably, some have received as identical copies of a young girl designated person of interest. 994. See discovery log for the duration. But are otherwise ineffective. So objects are returned to their original location after one hour. On August 31st, 2019, two cardboard boxes were delivered by mail to Site 19. Security personnel searched the boxes, finding 48 instances of SCP 4714 in the following letter. To my wonderful friends at the Foundation, here at Wondertainment Industries, we believe that the best toys are those created with only fun in mind. When we lose sight of that, we lose the spark that makes our products the best toys out there. And this is one of those times. Still, Chad has spared someone to blame for what Sal did, after all. He knew him long before I ever stepped into his office. So, take my toys, like you always do. Put them in a box. I don't want to see them anymore. All the best, Dr. Wondertainment. Gives off Willy really Wonka vibes. Apparently I'm missing something here. Oh, but Preliminary testing with SCP-4714 led to the discovery of, er, led to the discovery of SCP-4714-A, an abandoned ranch. An adjacent trailer was found to contain numerous copies of invoices sent to Ambrose restaurants. Group of Interest 116, detailing the sale of unicorn meat as well as invoices sent to Doctor One Entertainment. And incorporate outlying a mutual agreement for exchanging unicorn hair for quality assurance services. The meaning of this phrase remains unknown. Additionally, a photograph was located 
featuring an unknown man, person of interest 995, and a young girl, person of interest 994. Holding a of a t-shirt reading number one dad. The identities of these have been confirmed as Alice and Sal Blank. Inside a stable foundation first now found several saws that lead to broken that have been broken open from the inside. But then another saw which has been broken in into from the outside were the bodies of two individuals, one child and one adult. We should confirm that person and, and of interest 994 or and person of interest 995 respectively. Notably, Forest of Interest 994 was killed in an unrelated car accident roughly one month prior to discovery. Weird. The former shows signs of, of strangulation, while the latter bore numerous broken ribs and impalements. Investigation into the circumstances surrounding this incident are ongoing. As this is supposed to be a one off kind of thing where I just do a short video because of my originally planned video can't actually be produced today due to time constraints that weren't previously involved. I'm going to have to call it here. If you like this video, please like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. I know what I'm hoping to do tomorrow. So until then, goodbye.